Are you from the radio or the television? What's that plonker wearing? What the hell is that? I'm just standing around doing nothing. Just killing time. I'm homeless, but apparently there are no homeless. There's a mixture of some quite sad stories about people's bereavement, about people's illnesses, people's job losses. Don't panic, he's just reading the back. You look like a rock star. I got a lot of warm smiles. I got a lot of double checks. Some people avoided me. One person, for whatever reason, wasn't at peace with themselves and decided to swear at me quite a bit, which was, you know, his choice. For the Lincoln one, it made me smile because there's people on it that I think I know or know of. Recognising this, go on, mate, take a tissue, take a tissue. This particular rave work, if I talk to you, because I want to go and look at something I understand, which is a suit of clothes, and see the detail of the conversation. It really draws you in. My parents came from Jamaica. It's changed a lot. That's a good thing. Your suit, it's wicked. Where did you get it? I wish I had the confidence to wear clothes like that. Corby was a very green place. I was surprised that somewhere famous for steel had one of the biggest ancient woodlands I'd ever found. Um, so that gave the green. Purple seemed to fit with the kind of lack of greenery in the part of Nottingham I was walking with. Blue, partly just wanting a different colour for each one. And again, there were lots of blue skies when I was walking around Lincoln. The other suit was a catalyst suit. I recognised that I needed to do something to attract attention and that walking around as a plainclothes civilian, it wouldn't work. I wanted something that would somehow punctuate and break up the everyday. So between the fabric printer and the tailor and my own choice, I just like a shiny fabric would just stand out. I wanted it to feel kind of distinctive. My dad moved us here from Hartlepool 17 years ago when he met his girlfriend. It was expensive then, but now it's totally silly.